We just got a new action camera. This is the Cam Park ACT 74 4K sports cam. And we've taken it out of the box. We've charged the battery. And we want to take a look at the camera and what it comes with before we start using it. So as I mentioned, this is the Cam Park ACT 74 action camera. It's a 4K Wi-Fi enabled camera with a 170 degree wide angle lens. It includes a lot of accessories as you can see here, including a case that makes the camera waterproof. I, have, I purchased a GoPro Hero years ago and it came with nothing, nothing but the camera itself. So I ended up buying the accessories one by one and they were very pricey. I'm not sure currently what the, uh, you know, maybe the GoPro comes with more or accessory packs are available. They weren't available at the time, but I remember buying a head strap, a chest strap, every little mount separately. So I do like the fact that this comes with a lot of things to get started. Now what it doesn't come with, and I don't think any camera comes with that I've seen, is the um, SD card. So you'll have to purchase that separately to be able to use the um, SD, be able to use the camera. We got this one, the SanDisk, 32 gigabyte, up to 100 MB per second, you know, great. Um, especially since this is a 4K camera, UHD, um, make sure you get something very similar to this. Um, standard ones do have some issues when loading into a camera like this. At least that's what we saw from reading some of the reviews that some of the people had used um, uh, another type of SD card and, and had issues. Oh, you still have the, we still have the film over the screen. Yes. The uh, we'll lens, take rather. That off. So here is a better look at the camera. As you can see, it's all black. It's very small. It fits right in the palm of your hand. I think they do come in blue also. If you can check, check the Amazon link for that. There are some buttons on here, which makes it very easy to toggle through screens and everything like that. So here on the front, we have the mode slash on and off button. So to turn that on and off, you hold it down and to toggle through different um, screens, you just press it. On the top, we have the OK button. So that would be the button you use to select different options that you're trying to get into. On the side, we have an up and down arrow to help toggle through different things like setting the time that comes in very handy and different settings and screens you can toggle through with that. On the side, we have the um, HD output, the uh, your charging cord, and your SD card slot. I can show the battery compartment also. On the bottom, there's a battery compartment. Um, it was a little tricky to open, um, but we eventually did it, and it, now that we know how to open it, it's a lot easier. So um, I'm gonna turn this on to show you what the screen looks like. Holding down that front button. Yeah, I think the screen protector's still on there. Yes, it is. So as, as we mentioned, we haven't actually used the camera yet. We, we um, put a battery in and then charged it. We charged it in the camera. Um, so as you can see, put the SD card in, of course. The um, camera comes right up, very easy to access. So if I push the front button again, the power on off button with the mode, I can get different settings such as the 4K mode, slow mode, video, and stuff like that. And settings, so if I push settings, I have different options to go through such as being able to access Wi-Fi for being able to easily download things. There is an app for that, it's located in the instruction manual. 
Yeah, and I would refer anyone to the instruction manual um, in general um, because um, we're certainly not experts on this by any means. Um, we're just a typical user. Uh, we're going to show you the accessories it comes with and then we're going to actually use it for filming. Yes. And, um, see what kind of video we get. So as you saw, it's, it's fairly easy to use, be able to get through all the menus. It's not that hard. Um, it also, it's, it's just very easy to use. So let's take a look at these accessories. So of course we have the camera itself and an extra battery. It comes with two batteries. As you can tell, see this one hasn't even been used yet. We charged one so that we could uh, turn it on and start filming later. Um, there are some wipes and some 3M stickers as well as a wire to help with various designs and cleaning if uh, however you want to mount this. There are also some zip ties as well depending on what you're doing you might need them. Uh, there is a handlebar mount for if you're going to go biking or any type of activity regarding a bike uh, you are able to easily capture your experience or anything that happened um, here is the regular base mount um, i've seen a lot of people use this for um, you know car stuff if they're filming a race or anything they'll strap these onto their vehicle we have helmet bases there are two, so you can attach it onto whatever vehicle or helmet or design that you're uh, using and easily stabilize your camera. We also have the USB cable for charging and extracting video. In this baggie right here, we have the fixed base, which um, is a good way to make sure that it's stable and just straight. We have different switch connectors. There are three different types depending on what you're going to um, use and how you're going to use it. That's all up to you. Also in this bag you have an adapter as well. And you have the user manual like we showed earlier this user manual has all of the accessories the list of them and various different ways you can use the accessories to do what you're going to do and of course the ability to download the app for easily accessing videos over wi-fi also you um have bandages as they call them for um uh being able to strap your go or your camera where you need, such as maybe your wrist, your chest if you're small enough, or different other places as well. You also have clips here for other mounts. Maybe you're going on, um, you're using it on your belt buckle or something like that. And here is the back cover for sound. There are two slits here on the um, um, back case so that you're able to hear your video. It also has a card reader. Um, all you have to do is plug it into your computer and see everything that you filmed. Um, this is a great kit because it includes a lot of things. Um, like we mentioned earlier with GoPro, we uh, had to purchase just about every one of these pieces separately. So this is a great deal. You get your ultra uh, 4K HD camera with all the accessories for you to actually go out and adventure. So stay tuned and we'll show you some footage that we get with the camera.